Shalom. This is Sister Ebony. I'm sitting here in front of our cooking area. Um, can y'all grab the sticks over there and throw them into the fireplace? Because I can't do it. Boys. <clears throat> um, sitting here in front of the cooking area. Taking a break. Um, and just thought of something kind of funny. But... serious too because I, I think my thought is right on but I'm, I'm gonna get the answer here in a minute <laughs> um so my thought is <clears throat> women are to men uh women in the sense of women's emotions um and how they deal with them even uh when they have the answer um, not all women, but um, women in general are to men who say have, like we do a lot of natural remedies here. And this came to mind because of my master. <laughs> he deals with allergies and we've come up with a allergy tea, so to speak, but it does not taste the best. <laughs> and... If he would take it on a regular basis, we believe his allergies would subside um, and not be as bad. Or We don't know what the results will be. But because of the taste, um, we believe that he kind of avoids it, so to speak. Um, so kind of avoids the answer that he has or has been given. And I compare that to... Um, women in in their emotions say if they get the answer from their husbands or have the answer in general that they either have some excuse why they can't do it can't take the prescribed medicine so to speak so i thought that was funny um women women versus men and doing that what do you think about that master Why y'all bring me my 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 in a, my my that tea? We have we have natural remedies. Why well, gotta bring the tea into this? Like he just had, was it pink eye? Pink eye, or something? Actually, I got something in my eye. Something in his eye that, um, and even during the live stream, you seen he had to keep checking his eye and. And flushing it out and stuff like that. But we had looked up and even some of the sisters mentioned that breast milk can help soothe the eye and also help, you know, with any healing of it. So we've suggested breast milk, but he doesn't want to do it. <laughs> he, he doesn't even want to try it because it is sticky. I did try it. I don't like being sticky. <laughs> Everybody knows that. I hate being sticky. I don't like it when the children are sticky, and the children are sticky, and they don't even care if they're sticky. I can't stand being sticky. Even though we, we and suggested... you intentionally shoot and miss. <laughs> Let's not act like you don't shoot and miss intentionally. We suggested oh, having God, a wet rag, <laughs> a wet rag to wipe off any excess breast milk that may come out and flow and get him sticky and all that, but... Because he doesn't want to get sticky. He does okay, not want to try. Back to the point to you were saying initially. If what Yah yes, has given. <laughs> women do that. And yes, men even do that. They do it where, well, you know, there may, may be something good for us. And we won't necessarily, even though we know we should, do it. Because just like a lot of women are, we want to do our own way, apparently, and fail. <laughs> and then after we do it and fail, then we come back and say, okay, yeah, I'll try it your way. Let's <laughs> curious about what it's about. It's about women's emotions. Yes, yes, master. It's all all right. <laughs> so we have all these natural, um, growing wild herbs and things that help with allergies and respiratory things that we can put in the teas and stuff like that. So we, the women, have to come up with a good tasting tea for master, so he'll take it. 
<clears throat> is that what we have to do for our emotions? Make it good tasting? Make no, it feel good? No, no, no. <laughs> because I did take the tea. I will drink the tea, even though it's not great. Because I have drink it. Y yes, Master. I just don't want to take the, the, the prescribed amount that you would have me Yes, take. Master. And I think well, it's, it's similar to, to women as they don't necessarily want to hear the right answer. They want to hear the tastiest answer. Mm -hmm. So they go and find the answer that's most appealing to them. And that answer, I mean, how many women have you a Pookie or Ray Ray? So oftentimes that answer ends up being the answer that's most detrimental to them. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's kind of like getting the herbs that Yah has given us versus immediately running to the pharmacy, mm -hmm. pharmacia, and getting their prescribed, you know, dosages of whatever, whatever, whatever words you can't pronounce. So, I, I, yeah, it's, it's similar to that. I don't know. I thought that was a good analogy and decided to spring it on my master. Yeah, I'm going to plant seeds <laughs> and she's going to throw this in here. <laughs> Uh, that was point. that it's was funny. <clears throat> okay, that's all. Hope you all have a blessed day. Shalom.